Welcome once again. Right now we're at Titus chapter 2 verses 1 through 10. Paul wrote to Titus saying, But say the things which fit sound doctrine, that older men should be temperate, sensible, sober-minded, sound in faith, in love, and in perseverance, and that older women likewise be reverent in behavior, not slanderers, nor enslaved to much wine, teachers of that which is good, that they may train the young wives to love their husbands, to love their children, to be sober-minded, chaste, workers at home, kind, being in subjection to their own husbands, that God's word may not be blasphemed. Likewise, exhort the younger men to be sober-minded. In all things, show yourself an example of good works. In your teachings, show integrity, seriousness, incorruptibility. I like that word, incorruptibility. It means, well, it never has to be updated. It's always current. And soundness of speech that can't be condemned that he who opposes you may be ashamed, having no evil thing to say about us. Exhort servants to be in subjection to their own masters. So it doesn't say here in Scripture that servants should be in subjection to their masters. So it doesn't say that being a servant is a bad thing. It just tells the servants, it tells the slaves how to obey the masters. And likewise, may I add, it tells masters how to treat their servants, how to treat their slaves. Exhort servants to be in subjection to their own masters and to be well-pleasing in all things, not contradicting, not stealing, but showing all good fidelity, that they may adorn the doctrine of God our Savior in all things. Wonderful, wonderful portion of Scripture. Until next time, seek Him. Seek Him. I mean, pray. I mean, read the Scriptures. I mean, study. I mean, always think about the things of God. And be humble. Say, Lord, if I'm wrong, show me. If I'm wrong, help me to be humble enough not to oppose you, but to accept the truth even if it hurts. Seek Him with all your heart, and if you do, you will find Him. Call upon Him, and He will show you great and mighty things. Love you guys.